Hi guys, this is your girl Takayla, and I am opening up Amazon boxes because I am putting up my Christmas tree. As you can see in the background, it's a little blurry, um, but I am excited um, to be putting this up, y'all. I cannot wait for y'all to see it. Y'all know I'm different, so I'm opening up these Amazon boxes. I feel like I, as I'm opening up the boxes, I should be doing a little Christmas, I mean... Not Christmas song, but you know how they have songs when they open up stuff like Dora and Blue's Clues, like backpack, 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 or Amazon, Amazon, all the things that's loaded up with things and next to. <laughs> anyway, I am in love with Christmas. So one thing that my future husband needs to know about me is that I don't play about Christmas. And if he want to say something to me about Christmas... I'll put a Christmas tree up on Easter. Uh-uh. That's, that's ignorant. <laughs> I play too much. Um, but I am excited. Um, and I can't wait, y'all, so I can have these big turkey dinners and parties and have the big turkey, baby. I make the best turkey, okay? Lasagna, dressing, candy, yams, greens, cornbread, potato salad, homemade peach tea, berry lemonade, peach cobbler, banana pudding, chocolate chip cookies, uh, pumpkin, chocolate chip muffins, homemade. Y'all, I be throwing down and I cannot wait. I'm making myself hungry. <laughs> and I'm on a fast. I need to stop playing. Um, but I cannot wait. I cannot wait. I cannot wait for, um, I mean, I can't wait. I'm patient. But I'm saying, you know, those are going to be fun times where I can cook and be surrounded by family and friends and things like that um, for Christmas. Because, you know, now your girl is in L.A. and I don't really know uh, too many people here. Um, my dad and his side of the family. But, you know, there you go. Um, but anyway. I love Christmas and I am excited. I am excited about it. I am. And I don't really want anything. I just wanted to get out here um, and just talk to y'all um, while I was opening up some stuff. So, this is one of the things. Ouch, 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 ouch. That hurt. Ouch, Takaya. Ouch. Why would they put this sharp thing on here? That is crazy. It's crazy this thing was so sharp it hurts so bad anyway so these are baby breasts i think that's what they call them artificial okay because your girl ain't gonna deal with you no know, real flowers and real nets i already got plants um i don't know if y'all can see arnold right up there it's kind of blurry because of the um the camera but the baby I got plants already. I don't need no nets. I already, you know, got rid of the ones that was trying to come. But these are artificial. Very pretty to go on the Christmas tree, baby Brett. Um, and I got roses, right? Like, who puts roses on a Christmas tree? Me. I do. Takaya. <laughs> so, it's just going to be so beautiful. Um, so different. And I cannot wait. I also got orange peelings. Because I don't know if y'all remember. Um, but I redecorated not redecorated but when i decorated my apartment i have all these bright these orange um even this color yellow um bright just kind of reminds you of mexico a little bit um just these bright colors um in my living room and i wanted to get something that matched that so i know orange peelings is cool right but yeah my christmas tree gonna be so unique and so dope as always like me uh-uh not me too mom i want that but anyway, I cannot wait to put these on the tree. Hmm, this is interesting. I don't see holes. <laughs> I don't see holes or how to put them on the tree. Lord help. I'm going to make a way. Where there is a will, there is a way. These are so cute, but I don't see any holes, y'all. I'm going to have to punch a hole in this. Anyway... I am excited. I don't celebrate Halloween. And I'm skipping right to Christmas. I skip over Halloween and Thanksgiving. I love Thanksgiving too. Don't get me wrong. I love Thanksgiving, baby. Um, but, you know, I don't celebrate Halloween. So, I don't know what these kids. I be giving these kids candy every day in my neighborhood. And I am not giving them candy on Halloween. 
So mm -hmm. I don't celebrate it. I don't know what I'm going to tell them. They're going to be like, where's the candy lady who always give us candy? And I'm going to be like, baby, she gone. They're going to be like, ain't you her? I'm going to be like, no, this is a twin. <laughs> but not for real, though. I'm going to just tell them. I didn't restock. It's not a lie because my candy bowl is empty, but I feel like it's a premeditated lie because I really could have restocked. But, eh, oh well. I don't know what I'm going to do. I may just leave the house. Uh uh. Not me being dramatic. <laughs> leave the house. I don't want to disappoint the kids. But, um, <laughs> but anyway. Um, so that's that. Okay. And I skipped over October. Hey, man, look. Look. Holy Ghost helping me rhyme. Skip over October and get to December because that's the best month to remember. Uh-uh. <laughs> this thing is beautiful, but it is stinky. As I pulled it up out of this bag, it smells like vinegar. Jesus, let me put you back in your bag, honey. Oh, Jesus, it's going to get on my hands. Oh, it smells like vinegar. Farmhouse bees. You sure did come from a farm smelling like this. Smelling like a, a horse butt mixed with vinegar and cow manure. Anyway, <laughs> y'all play too much. Anyway, let me get out of here, y'all. I didn't want anything. Um, I just wanted to talk to you all and let y'all see my little tree. And I'll like edit the video and add the tree in here so y'all can see it. Um, I'm not going to be done with all of my decorations tonight. I know I'm going to put some lights up around my centerpiece and different things like that in, in the living room somewhere and around my TV, of course, and chest. Different things. I'll show y'all, you know, when I get done, just to update it. Christmassy living room feng shui, as they say. Um, but anyway. I just want to let y'all know that everything in your life, ooh, legs, <laughs> look, I'm uh, sitting in the Indian position for too long, um, but I just want to let y'all know that next year, um, it's going to be amazing, 2023, I'm actually already in the new year already, around September, y'all know that's the, when the Jewish New Year starts, um, I'm actually on that schedule because that's when stuff started, you know, making sense and stuff in my life around September of this year. So that's when the new year started for the Jewish calendar. And I'm kind of on that calendar. I mean, I'm on the other calendar too, but I'm kind of on the other one more. Um, so the new year already started for us. Um, but however, for all of you that are still pretty much in 2022, I want to let y'all know that this year, 2023... Um, it's gonna be amazing. Uh, it's y'all, it's gonna be the Lord gave me a prophetic word, and I don't know if I'm gonna release it tonight because we in October still. <laughs> but like I said, we already in the new year, you know. Um, you know, but anyway, <laughs> me being deep, but um. 2023 is going to be amazing, it's gonna be the year of the Lord's favor, okay, Lord. <laughs> Look, making sure I ain't get rebuked. Um, but I'm kidding. But now nah, it's going to be an amazing year, y'all. It's going to be a year where everything makes sense, where all of your hardships, your trials, all of it comes together. Just like um, much like Joseph, when he was pulled out of the pool pit and put into the palace, it's kind of going to be that kind of a testimony year 2023. So everything's going to make sense in 2023. Things are going to start lining up. And this is not for everybody, but for the ones who this word is for, for the ones who've been in the pit, for the ones who God has made promises to whether it's regarding your love life whether it's regarding your finances whether it's regarding your um career it's all gonna make sense and i just sudden blessings like that's how it's gonna happen suddenly suddenly you're gonna be shocked you're gonna be surprised and god is going to deliver his promises um and fulfill every word that he's spoken over your life so i just want to let y'all know that 2023 <sighs> It's going to be an amazing year, and I'm preparing for it now, um, fasting and praying, and just staying in alignment with the will of God for my life, and I am excited because I know it's going to be amazing. Um, yeah, but anyway, I don't want anything, y'all. I just wanted to come on here and talk to y'all because I haven't made a Living with Takaya video since I decorated my apartment, and like I said, I done went to Ross and Amazon, child ordered some more stuff, and it's even more beautiful than it was then, so I may do an update video. I may not. Um, or I may just show y'all my Christmas decorations. Um, I didn't do too much because my apartment already looks, not to brag, but it looks amazing. <laughs> you 
know I love decorated. It does look pretty good, so I don't need too much. Um, but I am gonna add some more Christmas lights. I just changed out a few of my colorful flowers and added these baby breads um, in the place of those to give it a more Christmassy vibe. But anyway, um, I am excited. I'm gonna finish this Christmas tree behind me, this beautiful tray. And um, yeah, next year is gonna be amazing, y'all. Well, this year, cause I'm, never mind. I don't have to keep saying it. <laughs> But next year is going to be amazing. So I just hope that y'all know that. I hope that y'all are ready for it. Because I'm ready for it, amen? I'm ready. <laughs> um, yeah. All right, y'all. I love you guys. And I will talk to you later.